A West Michigan home daycare has been shut down by state regulators. The Otsego Township business had its license suspended. News 8's Kyle Mitchell explains what we're learning about the investigation. The incident that led to the daycare's license being revoked happened earlier this month. State officials say one child was injured and taken to the hospital the next day. The Michigan Department of Licensing and Regulatory Affairs has suspended the license of Nancy Zenos, who operated a daycare at this home on Earl Street near Otsego. State documents allege the incident started on February 5th when Zeno was trying to get a child to lay down in a cot. The document says the child began jumping up and down on the cot. Daycare owner moved the child into another room. The redacted report says, quote, licensee grabbed child A by neck and pushed face down into cot. It then alleges she put her foot on the child's back. When the child's mother arrived, Zenos told her she didn't know how the child was injured. On February 6th, the child was examined at Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. We knocked on the door of the daycare for comment, but no one responded. The home daycare was licensed to care for up to 12 children. In Otsego Township, Kyle Mitchell, News 8.